the Old Republic and reign of great Jedi such as Revan, the remaining Sith grew to be extremely scared of the Jedi Order, as they witnessed a change in them that troubled them, even the most powerful of the Order, and made them question everything they knew about the Jedi. The great turn that made the Sith nearly terrified of the Jedi is when the Jedi Champion Revan went against the wishes of the Jedi Council and led nearly half of all Jedi Knights to war against the invading Mandalorians. As the Sith watched the Jedi from afar, they saw over the course of the war Revan change, as he would without hesitation and without mercy decimate those that came before his lightsaber. The Sith in this moment realized that the Jedi were changing, and it was because of this soul knight in Revan. You must realize that Revan was as great as a Jedi could be. Revan's tale shows us how even the greatest of Jedi can fall to the dark side. Our heroes had become brutal, conquering Sith and we were all helpless before them. Think about it. If you can't even trust the best of the Jedi, who can you trust? Although the people of the galaxy witnessed the Jedi destroying both the Sith as well as the Mandalorians, although the Jedi were freeing them from tyranny, they saw just how powerful and capable the Jedi were. They also saw how things that the Jedi had preached, such as mercy and understanding, fell to the wayside during the campaign of Revan. Revan was the first of a new breed of Jedi, and had embedded the Sith with something they had never felt for any Jedi in history, that of fear and respect. The Sith saw that he would not tolerate the dark side of the Force, or any of his enemies for that matter, and as a result of this intolerance, many Sith were destroyed by Revan himself. While one Sith Lord, Darth Vitiate, saw the opportunity to turn Revan and make him one of them, the rest of them feared him a great deal. Still though, the tale of Revan would remain for centuries, as he was the first of a new, more dangerous breed of Jedi that others such as Mace Windu would adopt down the line. Revan and Windu were Jedi that were faithful but were not to be tested or trifled with, and in many ways Revan and Windu are extremely similar, both being two of the most powerful Jedi in galactic history and being very different Jedi that is common. Both of them even choosing to wield the rare purple lightsaber to indicate their stance as a light side wielder who refuses to ignore that the dark side exists and instead uses it as a tool for good. But that is the deep connection between Revan and Windu and how Revan paid the path for the Jedi that would follow him centuries later in Windu. But leave your thoughts on this in the comments down below, and how do you think a proper Jedi should conduct themselves? Are you of the philosophy of Jedi such as Mace Windu or Luke Skywalker, or do you align more with that of Obi-Wan Kenobi and Yoda as to how a Jedi should conduct themselves? Overall, what are your thoughts on Revan as a character, and what depiction and time period is your favorite, Revan as a Jedi or Revan as a Lord of the Sith? As always, thank you guys so much for watching, may the Force be with you, and have a great day.